Welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to be setting up my binder in preparation for the Eyes Wide Open, I believe it's called. <laughs> Eyes Wide Open comeback by Twice this October. I'm really excited about it. I've really been trying to complete my Twice collection. I'm really almost done with it. I've had Mina complete for a while, but I'm almost done with Mina. I mean, sorry, Dahyun and Jihyo. I think I need a total of like 20-ish cards now, so that's really exciting, but I'm probably not going to finish it before the comeback, so I might as well go ahead and start up my binder in preparation for that, and then after the comeback, I can try and go back again to work on them, so yeah. But... The only thing I've done so far is just cut out little pieces of paper for the, um, it's like the slots to, like, in the binder. I'm gonna write on them, like, who, who it's for, like, what it is, basically, and just kind of put it to fill in the spot like I've done with my past, um, pages. I don't know. <laughs> I don't really, I've kind of changed the way I do it, so I don't really know how to explain it. But yeah, I'm really excited for the comeback. I am doing a group order for it for the United States if you're interested. The link will be down below to the Google form. Um, obviously, with, at the time I'm filming this, actually there is no pricing information, so I don't know anything about that yet. But just check the form once that comes out if you're interested and it'll have all the information there and I'll be posting about it on Twitter and Instagram. So. Yes. There are a lot of groups making comebacks this month. Um, I think the only other group I'm going to be collecting this month is Seventeen, so I'll do a video for them, but if there's anyone else that I do, I will make a video, like, setting up my binder. I mean, some someone that it'd be worth setting up for, like, if I just collect one member from the group, I'm not going to do it, but since these are my two alt groups, I feel like it'd be really interesting to see, and I like watching videos like this, so I'm going to make one too, so... Okay, so first, let me show you my little brainstorming page. <laughs> so here is where I've kind of laid out how I want it to look. It probably looks really confusing, but I will explain it. So it's been revealed that each member has 10 photo cards, and then there's 10 photo cards that are like shaded or like darker. And I don't know if those are going to be units or groups or what they're going to be. I'm assuming units like last time because um, they're included as like a normal photo card. So I'm going to assume they're units for now. I just don't know what the units are. And there's 10 of them, so I'm not really sure how I'm going to collect them. With the last album, there was enough for me to split it among two pages and it look nice. But with just 10... Uh, that'll leave one extra card off of the nine pocket page, so I'm not really sure what I'm going to do. So once we, like, I actually get to see what they are, I'll decide how I'm going to do those. So for now, I'm just going to have an extra page just for those to go somewhere if I do plan on collecting them. But again, once um, we get more info on what they actually are, I'll probably change it. Um, so I'm using all nine pockets for now for these. So um, I have three biases and twice and for every era I collect at least one OT9 set and since every member has 10 cards it makes sense to put um, nine cards of each bias on one page to fill in a nine pocket and then that leaves them each with one extra card so I just put those extra cards towards an OT9 set so as you can see here, like this is Jihyo, Mina, and Dahyun. Those are nine of their cards, and their tenth cards will go on this page as long as well as other cards from other members that match the set. Again, I don't really know what the photo cards look like yet, so I don't know what OT9 set I'll collect, but I usually collect the one where they do a signature. Um, like in their past eras, they do you know, different borders and one of them is a signature. So I usually do that set, but if there isn't one, then I will decide, um, which one I'll do after looking at them. And, um, the preview photo that we got, the photo cards were actually colored to each member's representative colors. So I'm hoping that means the cards are the colored borders, like what is love and fancy rather than feel special more and more. They didn't really have the colored borders. More and more didn't really have a lot of border, and they were just different, like, 
concepts, I guess. Feel Special had like certain borders, but I'm hoping it's going to be more like What is Love in fancy photo cards. And then I do have a spot where I was just like, I need three pages for the pre-order cards because I always pre-order, so I always get the cards. Even if I didn't pre-order, I would try to get the pre-order sets. And then, so there are some extras that we know of. We get a most card in this, which is kind of weird because the doesn't really go with the name of the album this time, but I think that's probably just something they're going to do in Twice albums now, so we get a most card. And I'm going to get one of each album at least. I'll probably buy six copies, maybe nine copies of this album, depending on how much they are and if I really like them, because I do collect three members, so... Um, and some OT9 sets and maybe even extra cards depending on what the extra 10 cards are. So um, I plan on buying a lot of copies. So now I'll have at least three of the most card. So on this page, I'm just going to like present them. And then it also says we have message cards. Now I think they're a little bit bigger, but I think if they're turned sideways that they'll fit up in uh, like side to side they'll fit in there, but maybe they'll be a little too tall. So I'm putting them in the middle row and leaving the top row blank just so it's not covering anything in the top row. So that's why that's blank. Um, but this is just for Jihyo, Mina, and Dahyun's. And then this is just an unknown page. I don't know what those 10 cards are. So I'm just going to put in an extra page just in case I decide to collect those. And then this was my key for myself. So yeah, so it looks like we're going to need a total of nine sleeves, right? And pocket pages for now it might change, but yeah, so I do have those already. So I'm basically going to slip them into my binder, but first I'm going to label all of these little... Um, placeholders that I've already cut out. So I'm gonna make them say like Jihyo, Mina, Dahyun, and then for the OT9 sets, and then the extra stuff like the most card and the message card and that kind of thing. I'm not gonna have um, any placeholders for the pre-order cards because it's kind of pointless because I buy the sets so there's really no need to leave spaces for who I'm getting because I'm getting them all. And then for the unknown stuff, I don't know what to label it, so I'm not going to put anything on there. So I have enough for the bias pages, the OT9 page, and the extras page that we know of. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm not going to talk while I do it. I'll just like kind of zoom in because it's pretty self-explanatory. I'm just writing their name on it so I can put it into my binder. So I am really quickly going to do that and let you watch. <laughs> and then I will come back when we're putting everything in my binder and how it's going to look. These are like my favorite types of videos, so I hope you guys like seeing them. I really like seeing how people plan out their binders before a comeback. I think it's really interesting to see how we all collect. So, yes. <laughs>
so I finished making all the little placeholders. I wanted to explain them just a little bit really quickly. So here is a GQ one. So um, basically I just, you know, wrote her name in a marker that uh, is the closest I have to her color. Same with Mina and that hand is white, which I'm writing on white paper. So kind of impossible. So I just went with a light gray, but um, so I just have their name in their color, color. <laughs> And in this box, I'm just going to put um, which like photo card it is, like which border it is, basically. Basically, kind of like with, um, I don't know, Feel Special, they had like a brown sparkly border. I would write that on it. So just the different kind of borders, I'll write it in the, the little box, but we don't know any of that yet. So I'm leaving it blank for now, but when we get more information, I'll go back and write it in there and that kind of thing. Um, and then, you know, these are the OT9 ones, so same deal. And then these ones, since they're like the special things, I didn't need a big box. So I just kind of simply wrote what it was and kind of just try to make them look prettier with the cursive over top of it. But now we can go ahead and get into my actual binder and putting them in there. Let me fix the angle a little bit so we can see it. You know, I have not bought another tripod I don't know why I just never think to do it and I always remember right when I'm filming videos so here is the binder I'm going to flip all the way to the back where we'll be setting up because I don't want to spoil anything for finishing my toys collection so here's a page that we have seen before you know Mina's been complete so this is what I was talking about so if I were to put a spacer here I'd put Mina brown sparkly border or here Mina gold border or Mina white border that kind of thing so that's what I'm going to do with the other cards okay so here is where more and more ended my desk is a really odd shape and my setup is kind of strange so I hope this is okay to see but so right here we're gonna put in the five pages right here maybe six yeah it's six actually so we'll do one for this is the last page this is the unknown stuff that's just kind of there this is for the message cards and the most cards this is for the ot9 set and then one for each of my biases one two and three and I actually miscounted I need one more sleeve for for the pre-order sets okay so we'll put those in right now as well I'm not gonna you know do anything with them there's no fillers so that's gonna go in them so here is where more and more was and we'll put these three in there and they'll just sit here. I'm not going to put fillers in them like I said. And actually, let me check because I do have all the group cards separate. I don't know if I need to add a page for... Nope. Okay. So the group cards for the next album will go in these three spots. I'll just leave those fillers in there for now. But let's get back to this. So basically, really quickly, I'm just going to fill in what we are planning for. <laughs> my binder all set up for the comeback. I'm really excited. I cannot wait to see 
what the concept photos are like. I love collecting twice photo cards. It's honestly so fun. I completed more and more very quickly. So just because I entered so many group orders and bought so many albums, I had enough to just trade. So I'm really excited to collect twice again. I mean, I know I've been collecting them throughout this whole time, but a new comeback. I'm just really excited to see what all the photo cards are for the first time and things like that. So I hope you guys are ready for a lot of videos about twice because when my alts make a comeback, I go crazy. So I'm really excited and don't worry. 17 is coming soon as well. I'm even more excited. So yes, but I don't think I'll show you guys my binder again until I get my first pulls and we sort those in like I always do. Um, and obviously by then we'll know like the different types of cards and versions. So these will be updated. And if I get lucky and pull it up any of them, um, that'll be fun to see. So yes, I'm very excited. I can't wait for it to happen. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed seeing this video, seeing this process. I really enjoy seeing it. So I hope it was helpful to you guys if you're interested in, you know, collecting twice for this comeback. Um, if you are, let me know who you're collecting and what you're most excited for in terms of the comeback. Also, if you're interested in joining a group order for this album, I am hosting one, um, but I also will link some other ones that are outside of the US that are from like mutuals or friends that are hosting them. So if you're interested in looking for a group order, check my description. I'll have mine and other people's linked, other USA ones too, if you're not looking for mine. I'm joining, um, or sorry, I'm ordering from Weavers. So if you guys are trying to order from somewhere else, I'll leave people who are in the U.S. ordering from different places, but I'm going to order through, did I just say Weavers? Why did I say Weavers? That's 17. I'm ordering from Music Plaza. I always do. Um, I know people are like ordering from Great Music CD, K-Town For You, K-Pop Market 01, that kind of thing. So I will leave all kinds of links. So yes, but yeah, so that is all I had for this video. Again, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, Please support Twice in their comeback. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.